Hi, I'm Jamie Warsell of jamiehair.com, and today we're going to talk about mascara maintenance. The materials that you'll need are black or dark brown mascara, washable or waterproof, foundation, concealer, and powder. The first step would be to make sure that your mascara uh, isn't too old to use. Um, if it's more than six months old, you want to get a new one, and um, a way you could determine that is whenever you buy a new mascara, put a little sticker on it and put the date um, that either that you bought it or six months from now so you'll know when to throw it out. Okay, the next step that you'll want to do is to prep your under eye area. If you have any dark circles, you want to cover those with concealer or foundation and then set it with powder just so the mascara on your bottom lashes doesn't run onto your skin. Okay, and then the next step is to curl your lashes. Um, a trick that I do is I'll hold my mascara or my eyelash curler in my hand just to warm it up a little bit and the heat will kind of help to curl it and also you won't have this cold metal against your eye. And, um, and then what you'll do is just uh, take your eyelash curler, start at the base, um, squeeze it, and then continue to squeeze as you pull it out to give it a more natural curl instead of a bent look. The next step after you curl your eyelashes is to put on some clear mascara or a mascara primer which are usually white in color and this will help to hold the curl uh, that you just did and also give the mascara something to hold on to and make it last longer. And the final thing to consider about mascara maintenance is to use waterproof. If you're going to an event where you know you're going to cry like a wedding or something or if it's summertime and it's hot out and you know you're going to be sweating so your mascara doesn't run. And those are some tips on mascara maintenance.